y'all, welcome back to the channel. It's Adrienne, hope you guys are doing good today. So I'm gonna flip the camera around and show you my Walmart haul that we just did. Y'all, let me go ahead and tell you, everything got drenched, including Ava and I. Like we got soaked. It was raining. It's actually a thunderstorm warning right now. So yeah, I didn't realize that it was gonna pour down like it did, but we got drenched and a lot of our groceries got soaked through. Um, it's okay for the most part because almost everything that got really wet, we're gonna end up taking it out of its original package anyway, so it's fine. Um, but I am gonna go ahead and flip the camera around and I'll show you our haul, starting with Walmart. All right, so starting right here, I'm gonna show you my beautiful, beautiful brioche bread that I love. So we have the sliced bread, we have the hot dog buns, we have the hamburger buns. They're a little bit like, they've moved around some because of just, we were rushing to get everything in the in the car, but yeah, we love this brioche bread. Um, it's pretty much all that we buy right now, so that's that. I got Cheetos, white cheddar Cheetos. I got some tortilla chips. Um, these are actually new. These are the Odell Paso uh, pockets, tortilla pockets. I saw this on. Um, I think it was Instagram. Like I find a lot of new foods, new products to try on Instagram. Like I follow a bunch of like Costco girls and Dollar Tree girls and just all kinds of everything. And that's how I find out about new stuff. As soon as I see something, I'm like, oh my God. So I'll go to like the Walmart app or Amazon app and look it up and see if they have it. These are some Pride Oreos. Um, they're like plain, they're just a regular white cream, uh, but they have like different writings up here. It says real words from proud allies, add yours. And it's just little comments and things that people have written in. So I thought that was cute. Hopping over here, I have, I bought a three pack of this hamburger, this organic grass fed ground beef. We honestly, if you are just tuning in to my channel, if this is your first video, I have a deep freezer full, this guy right here, full of meats and um, seafood and all kinds of stuff. So you're not gonna see a ton of meat right now. <laughs> so, um, but yeah, I just got this three pack. I try to get one of these, at least one of these, um, whenever we do go grocery shopping because of what we have so far, just to keep it kind of stocked. Um, we don't eat a lot, like a ton of beef, but I like to have it on hand. Like I'm cooking some like hamburger helper ish type something tonight so yeah i just i like to have this on hand and i like the squares it's really easy for me to um i cu usually uh cut them across like this and then i stack them in the basket in my freezer um but moving on i got some new york strip strip steak for gabriel and i my daughter like i just came to realize that my daughter does not like steak I'm like, who are you? Like, who doesn't like steak? But yeah, she doesn't like steak, so that's pretty much for me and Gabriel. Um, I got some curly fries. I got some checkers fries. Um, a lot of the stuff that we got, honestly, y'all, is new. Like, new items that I haven't seen before or I haven't tried before. This is one of them. It's called DB's Organics. I have seen this before, but I never actually saw it in store in Walmart. So um, they had a ton of them in like one of those little mini co coolers um, back in like the dairy section. So I grabbed these. They're organic superfruit freezies. I love freezy pops, y'all. No organic colors, flavors, or preservatives. Y'all have to excuse my phone interrupting um i'm actually gonna skip over here okay sorry about that so my, um, look at my table. This table has been through the ringer. Here is a prime example of everything getting wet. Like this is, you might, I don't know if you can tell it on camera, but 
it is completely soaked but this is a cinnamon toast crunch y'all cinnamon toast crunch is like everywhere like they have invaded our food supply but this is the instant oatmeal i wanted to try this like we have tons of oatmeal but i actually wanted to try the cinnamon toast crunch oatmeal it's just a six pack so i wanted to see what it tastes like um i got a container of barbecue and this is actually made in north carolina so that actually made me feel a lot better about buying it because it's close by um i got coleslaw to go with that because you can't have barbecue without coleslaw um ava wanted to try some of these um she's had these before but she wanted to get some of these for breakfast like in the morning times eogs are coming up so um you know they only have honestly i think they have like 16 more days of school so it's not a lot to be honest with you um i got cinnamon toast crunch for my son um also more cinnamon toast crunch this is the can't talk more cinnamon toast crunch these are the cinnamon rolls I've, and this is another thing that i have been seeing online but i never could find it in store so finally found it and snatched it up um this is these are mini sticks mini cinna sticks i've never seen these before actually so i got those um i got a two pack of these grand buttermilk biscuits uh, another container of cocoa whip y'all this is so 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 good like to be a vegan product this is ridiculously good it's so so good you got to try it um ava has been wanting to try sushi for a while now so she picked this up Cal classic california roll we shall see how that tastes um, and then this is another thing that she picked out hard salami it has cheese on the inside um She's going to be like last two weeks of school and she has decided that she wants to start taking her lunch again. So anyway, she got some ham and turkey. I picked up these two marinade in a bag. This one is the roasted garlic and herb. This one is garlic parmesan. Um, let's see. She just walked away <laughs> with the sushi. Um, this is the summer edition Red Bull. Uh, really Gabriel and I drink Red Bulls occasionally so I just got the two of those for us we have Nutella we have some sour cream right there uh, Kinder's I didn't realize how many products Kinder's has until I was looking online at Walmart on Walmart um, in the app and um, so they had these little ones so I thought this is nice if you want to just try something to see how it is gonna taste so this is the blackened with cayenne and lemon and then there's another little one this one let's see oh, dropped it this one is the barbecue blend if i can get my camera to focus um let me see let me hold it like this there we go barbecue blend and then they have mild barbecue sauce ava wanted some like regular just plain barbecue sauce so she got that um finally trying this slap your mama Cajun seasoning. I really, really, really want to try the, um, oh, what is her name? The vegan lady. Um, oh, I can't think of her. What is her name? Tabitha, Tabitha something. I can't remember her last name right offhand, but, um, she has a seasoning, like her own seasoning that came out a while back. And I think it was like a limited supply or whatever. So I'm like on the lookout for when she puts that back out because I want to get some of that. Um, then we have our cheeses. So I got a block of mild cheddar cheese, which is my favorite. Um, this is new. La, La Morenita. Some quesadilla cheese. Um, and then I got these mild cheddar cheese sticks for both Ava's lunch and then also my lunch, like when I go to work. Um, I have a twin pack of just the regular singles. Ava got this can of sardines. And we have our beautiful milk supply. Um, but first, I have a, bought a bottle of olive oil. I was tempted to buy a really, really big one, but I said, let me just get this for right now. And then if I get a bigger one, I'll get it from Costco. But y'all, milk. So this is my absolute favorite milk. Y'all have seen me buy some milks over the time, over time, but this is my favorite. It's Mayenberg goat milk. This stuff is so, so good. 
honestly better than all four of these or three of these brands combined like this is really 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 good it goes down really well you know how you can tell in my opinion you know how you can tell if a milk is really really good if you when you pour it in the glass if it just, if the milk just rinses down the glass, like it doesn't stick to the glass, there's no film on the glass. To me, that's that's not gonna be a good milk. I like for my milk to like stick. If there's a film, a milk film on the glass, then that tells me it's gonna be some good milk. And that is really, really good. It's very expensive. It's like almost $5 for this little <laughs> like quart. It says one quart but trust me when i say it's it's worth it it's really really good but again it's really small that'll be gone in probably like three or four days maybe um i had a cup of this one night right before bed and oh it was some good sleep some really really good sleep anyway moving on i got planet oat milk so i have oat milk I have grass milk. I like oat milk um, and I am actually this week I'm going to be prepping for um, breakfast. I'm going to be doing some overnight oats. So that was kind of sort of what I got that for. My son likes this kind of milk uh, like regular uh, cow milk. Uh, Ava likes almond milk which we both like we we Ava and I will drink whatever but yeah we just got this and then also chocolate milk they both like the chocolate milk i don't like chocolate milk at all but they like chocolate milk and they like this brand so i got them that so that is our little milk collection back here we have some florida natural which is pretty much what i always get in terms of oj with the pulp i like the heavy pulp but that was all they had for now um the tostitos cheese to go with the nachos over there and y'all look at this look at this look at this this is brand new this is the biscoff cookie butter it's like a it's a cookie bar like a chocolate bar basically um it i have never tried this before what did i see i think i saw this on instagram i saw this on instagram and like almost dropped the phone i was like i have to have that so this is the milk chocolate they also have one of these in dark chocolate but um yeah and it's a pretty it's a pretty hefty bar like you can see how thick it is um i wonder how many servings six servings per container so yeah it's it's a pretty pretty heavy duty bar and i got three of them for each of us because all of us like this golf <laughs> like love it um i got some of these nature ba nature's bakery fig bars this one's blueberry and this one is raspberry there are others that are online um, i'm gonna have to order them but these were the only two that they had in store um jumbo jumbo popsicles remember these i don't know if y'all remember these but i remember these from when i was a kid seeing these and i think maybe even having these before but these are the jumbo like this is literally how big it is actual size that's how big it is so look at my hand in comparison <laughs> so this is a box of 27 um and i think it was like seven dollars and something so i thought that was pretty good i wanted the kids to try it um i have these well ava picked this out again for these last two weeks of school it's just an 18 pack of um chips in there i showed you those popsicles already and then last but not least i got another container of eggs i can't grab it but y'all take my word for it that's the eggs right there but this is our little walmart haul it's not big at all um let me flip the camera oh oh my god 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 <laughs> i completely missed this stuff and the pop tarts okay let me show you the pop tarts so i got the pop tarts we always get these i never get pop tarts to have the icing on it to me it's just really 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 sweet um and these are like already sweet enough so i got these they're just plain unfrosted pop tarts and i love them but this <laughs> how did i miss this like how did i get all the way around this table and miss this, completely miss this anyway these are the um stranger things surfer boy pizzas um the boxes if you can already tell are completely soaked um but fortunately they're in plastic so i'm just gonna take these out and um yeah look at that look at that y'all when i say it was raining today it was it was raining um but anyway yeah these are the the p and that's the bottom sorry so i think there were four different flavor or not flavors but four different toppings so this one is the supreme 
um and it's like falling apart this one is multi meat so supreme multi meat and then this one is pepperoni this one survived pretty pretty well for the most part i thought it was super super cool it's like that old school pizza box um the other one was hawaiian it was like pineapple and uh jalapeno peppers and i was like yeah nobody here is gonna eat that so did i show you the nutella maybe i did maybe i didn't but we got nutella um i do believe that that is it yeah so now let me flip the camera back around um yeah we didn't get a whole lot one because i know that i'm going to costco and i know that i'm going to be at some point um not today but at some point i'm going to be going to aldi as well um i like aldi's seafood supply <laughs> so um, i am going to be getting some more uh shrimp in particular i miss my shrimp so i haven't had shrimp in a while actually so i'm going to be getting more shrimp there and i may get a couple more packs of meat we'll see um but yeah this this wasn't this was mostly a, a want kind of things that we wanted um getting ava some things for these last couple weeks of school getting myself a few things like right, from so work I'm the costco haul from the car just because it's easier i got these uh organic strawberry lemonades finally found the snickerdoodle cakes i've been seeing these on instagram so i'm happy i got those we have macaroons that we're trying we are finally trying the sorbet I've seen them everywhere. We got peppers. We have fruit bananas I got three more packs of ground beef and then the wagyu beef. We have Irish butter. We have Dragon fruit. This is my first time trying this. I've always tried the acai, but never had the dragon fruit. We have uh, Blackberries and finally found some seeded grapes. I haven't seen seeded grapes in a while So that's our Costco haul Okay, last but not least, we got this broom set from Costco. It's basically two brooms and a dustpan that's attached. I'm gonna use one for inside, one for outdoors. Thank you so much for watching this video and I will see you guys in the next one.